How do you choose the right boxer behaviorist? Choosing a behaviorist for your boxer can be a daunting task. As a responsible pet owner, you want to ensure that your furry friend receives the best possible care and guidance when it comes to their behavior. Boxers are known for their playful and energetic nature, but they can also exhibit some challenging behaviors without proper training and guidance. This is why choosing the right boxer behaviorist is crucial in order to address any behavior issues that may arise. With so many options available, it's essential to do your research and consider several factors before making a decision. Here are some key considerations to keep in mind when choosing the right boxer behaviorist. 1. Qualifications and Experience One of the most important factors to consider is the qualifications and experience of the behaviorist. Look for someone who has a background in animal behavior and training, preferably with specific experience working with boxers. They should be licensed or certified in their field and have an understanding of canine behavior. Ask for references or look for testimonials from previous clients to get an idea of their track record. 2. Positive Reinforcement Techniques It's crucial to find a behaviorist who uses positive reinforcement techniques. Positive reinforcement focuses on rewarding desired behaviors rather than punishing undesirable ones. Avoid behaviorists who rely on punishment or harsh methods as these can have detrimental effects on your boxer's well-being. A good behaviorist will employ positive reinforcement techniques to encourage and reward your boxer for good behavior. 3. Individualized Approach Every boxer is unique and their behavior issues may vary. Look for a behaviorist who takes an individualized approach and tailors their training methods to your specific boxer's needs. A one-size-fits-all approach may not be effective for all dogs, so it's important to choose a behaviorist who understands this and can adapt their techniques accordingly. For ongoing support and education, behavior issues may take time and effort to resolve, so it's crucial to choose a behaviorist who offers ongoing support and education. A good behaviorist will provide you with the tools and knowledge to continue training your boxer even after your sessions are over. They should be available for follow-up consultations and be willing to answer any questions or concerns that may arise. 5. Positive Reputation Look for a behaviorist with a positive reputation within the dog training community. Ask for recommendations from veterinarians, fellow boxer owners, or local training clubs. You can also check online reviews and ratings to get an idea of the behaviorist's reputation. A behaviorist with a positive reputation is more likely to provide quality services and have satisfied clients. 6. Compatibility with your dog Lastly, consider the compatibility between the behaviorist and your boxer. Observe how they interact with your dog during initial meetings or consultations. Pay attention to the behaviorist's demeanor, their ability to handle your boxer, and how your boxer responds to them. Choosing someone who has a good rapport with your boxer will make the training process more effective and enjoyable for both parties. In conclusion, choosing the right boxer behaviorist is essential for addressing any behavior issues your furry friend may have. By considering factors such as qualifications, experience, positive reinforcement techniques, individualized approach, ongoing support, reputation, and compatibility, you can make an informed decision and find a behaviorist who will help your boxer become a well-behaved and happy member of your family. Remember, investing in professional help for your boxer's behavior will pay off in the long run and ensure a harmonious relationship between you and your beloved pet.